Hey guys, it's Miss Wagers, and we are working on lesson 14. So, lesson 14 is focusing on subtraction, and the first problem that we are doing is number 1G. So, number 1G is 124,006 minus 121,117. So, when you're doing a subtraction problem, you want to first check your digits. So, I'm going to look across the top digits to make sure that I have enough on the top to subtract from the bottom. So if I'm going to just highlight real quick these top digits, and we'll see. So if I have 6 here, do I have enough to subtract 7? Well, if I have 6, I can't take 7 away, so I don't have enough. Okay, so I'm going to leave that highlighted because I, I, I know I need to go back and look at that. Okay, now the next digit I have 0. Is that enough to subtract 1? No, of course not. I'm going to highlight that. And again, the same thing. I have 0, and I can't subtract 1. Now I have 4. Is 4 enough to take away 1? Yes, of course. So that one has enough. If I have 2, can I take 2 away? Yes, I can. And if I have 1, can I take 1 away? Of course. So let's go back here to the 6. The 6 is not enough to be able to take 7 away. There's no tens and there's no hundreds. So I'm going to have to come all the way over to the thousands place and I'm going to regroup from there. So I'm going to change these four thousands. I'm going to take one. So I'm only going to have three thousands left and I'm going to turn that fourth thousand that I'm regrouping into ten hundreds. So now I have enough hundreds to subtract here, but I also need to keep going. So I'm going to regroup one of these hundreds, so which leaves me with nine hundreds. And I turn one of those hundreds into ten tens. Now again, that gives me enough to subtract that one, but I have to keep going. So I'm going to take one of those away. So that's going to be nine and I'm regrouping it into 10 ones plus the six that I already have is 16. Now I have enough to subtract. 16 is bigger than nine. Nine is greater than one. Nine is greater than one. Three is greater than one. And I can do the subtraction here. So you can actually subtract in any order now that you have enough in each place value to subtract. So 16 minus 7 I know is 9. 9 minus 1 is 8. 9 minus 1 is 8. 3 minus 1 is 2. And 2 minus 2 is 0. And 1 minus 1 is 0. So I'm not going to write that down. So my answer is 2,889. So if you need to look at this more, make sure you pause the video because I'm moving on. Okay, the next problem we're looking at together is number three. So it says a newspaper company delivered 240,900 newspapers before 6 a.m. on Sunday. There were a total of 525,600 newspapers to deliver. How many more newspapers needed to be delivered on Sunday? Well, we want to use a tape diagram to solve this problem. So I'm going to first start by drawing a rectangle. Okay. So here is my rectangle. I might actually want to move that down just a little bit. Okay. So I know the total number of newspapers that needs to be delivered for the day is 525,600. So this whole thing is worth 525,000 600. Okay. It says that 240,900 have been delivered so far. I think that sounds like a little less than half. So I'm going to put it right here. I'm going to call this part 240,900. And the question is how many more newspapers need to be delivered? So I'm going to use that as a variable and I'm going to mark that as A. So I know the problem that I need to solve this problem is 525,000 600 minus 240,900 equals A. Now I am going to write this up and down so I can solve. So 525,600 minus 240,900. Again, the first thing I want to do is check my digits and make sure that I am good to subtract. So 0 is enough to subtract 0. Again, 0 is enough to subtract 0. I have 6 here. 
That's not enough to subtract nine. So I am going to go ahead and regroup that right now because this five is enough to subtract zero. So this five, I'm gonna regroup one and leave that, that leaves me with four. I'm gonna add 10 hundreds to the six. So I'm gonna have 16 hundreds, okay? Four is still enough to subtract zero. Uh-oh, two, I'm gonna highlight that as well. That is not enough to subtract the four. So again, I'm going to regroup. I'm gonna take one from the five and leaves me with four and add 10 more to that two. So I have now have 12 and four is enough to subtract two. So now that I have enough on the top, I can just do my subtraction. So I have zero, zero minus zero is zero. 16 minus nine is seven. Four minus zero is four. 12 minus four is eight and four minus two is two. So my answer is 284,700. So if I write that in word form, um, I am going to say 284,700 more newspapers need to be delivered whoops delivered on Sunday I'll scroll that up so you can see all right guys have oh wait you have an assignment pause if you need to keep looking and your assignment is 1b 1e 1h number two and number four. Now you guys have a fantastic day.